hey Camilla so I my phone is blurry because like the cameras kind of got messed up so sorry about that any case uh, I wanted to kind of just do this March military thing for you um, and just kind of like break down what's going on between when you do the 16th notes and all that stuff so the first thing that I'd like to do is I'm going to start on the last measure of the second line okay and I'm going to put the camera in in foot cam mode all right hopefully I won't mess anything up I'm going to try really hard not to squeak and squawk all right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play just like the last measure of the second line and and the first measure of the third line okay all right here goes I got to translate this from bass clarinet so hopefully it won't mess up all right oh and my next strap is not the right line all right here goes ready I'll count myself four taps to start and again I'm starting on the last measure of the second line one two ready go all right so watch that again so um, assuming that your foot is tapping just like mine just did right then then you're going to be good to go but if not i'd like you to practice to get that foot tap just like that and play that part so let me do it now i'm going to start on the last measure of the first uh, the second line and i'm going to go all the way to the dc alcoda okay so here goes one two ready go let's see wrong note let me try it again one two ready go all right so far so good now watch how simple the beginning is Sorry about the wrong notes. I'm translating from clarinet. So what was happening when you were during your lesson just now is that those notes were coming out like they were all coming out the same length instead of okay. Sorry about that. That came out better that time, note-wise. But <clears throat> so, what the trick is is to get. Let me this to go in the same direction. I hope that. I hope this isn't turning sideways on you. It may it may actually be turning sideways. All right, that might be better. <laughs> Oops. So, in any case, the thing is, you have to maintain the same steady beat, changing from those eighths and sixteenths and all that crazy stuff back to more calm notes like quarter notes and eighth notes, which is what happens at the beginning, all right? But you have to be able to do it consistently. The, the thing of it was, you were able to do the first measure correctly, but then the next time you did it, it the notes didn't come out with the correct uh, rhythm, all right? So what I'm gonna do right now, uh, at risk of making you sick, I'm gonna turn this sideways again into the foot cam mode, all right? And hopefully, let's see how this works. I'm gonna play the whole thing from the beginning. All right, no mess ups, I hope. One, two, ready, go. Thank you. 
Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> uh, like, I'm, I'm not trying to make excuses, but I was trying to translate from clarinet and I got messed up. Anyway, I hope that helps, all right? So I'll send you the link to this and hope it helps you out. Bye.